Um, I think it's right to say that uh, the media has reported on a lot of things during uh, the pandemic and what we are noticing is maybe some people are a little bit concerned about what it might be like uh, supporting people in services during COVID-19. Um, I feel incredibly proud of how incredible the teams have been. We've been able to provide a, 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 a critical day service right from the start of lockdown, where we'll be able to um, act and respond to families um, that needed support during the pandemic when everybody was told we couldn't go out and couldn't go anywhere. Um, the, the, the support in and around all of the teams in making sure that we were fully equipped with PPE, that we were really robust with our risk management strategies, how we communicated and uh, reassured our teams um, was a really important piece of work that we wrapped our arms around our teams to ensure we kept people safe. But moreover, making sure that we made our teams feel really confident about what they were doing in a time that was very, very frightening. Um, obviously, you would have heard on the news about the limitations of people living in care homes. Again, we've had some fantastic stories of people really living life to the fullest within the, con the confinements of how they've had to lead their lives for which is now nearly two years.